Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. One of the fundamental teachings of Islam is the belief in the oneness of God. Islam lays emphasis and places premium on teaching his followers that Allah is one. He has no subordinate. He has no partner. He seek not help from anyone. And as a matter of fact, this teaching, this principle, is one of the core teachings of the early prophets. Prophets like Prophet Ibrahim, Prophet Musa, Prophet Isa, who is regarded as Jesus Christ, taught this principle. The book of Deuteronomy 6 verse 4 have it that Moses is reported to have said, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one God. As well, during the time of Jesus Christ, Jesus is reported to have said in the book of Mark 12 verse 28, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one God. The Quran has it in Quran chapter 2 verse 1 and 63, Wa ilahukum ilahum wahid, la ilaha illa huwa, Ar-Rahman Ibrahim. Allah says, Indeed, verily, your Lord is one Lord. There is no one besides Him. There is no one comparable to Him. There is no one superior to Him. And verily, He is the magnificent, He is the most, is the most beneficent, He is the most merciful. And this brings us to the question, if Muslims, if Islam teaches that Allah is one and He is not two, how then does the Quran address God using the plural we? Experts in social linguistic and discourse analysis have referred to the use of we as the royal we. The use of we by Allah in the glorious Quran does not synonymously mean that Allah has become two, three, or four. Rather, it is regarded as honorific plural or plural of respect. Monarchs, kings, and high profile people make use of this plural, this plural we when they want to make authoritative statements just to lay emphasis on their position and authority you will see them making statements like we are declaring a two weeks holiday we are declaring a public holiday tomorrow this is to emphasize and make people understand that they are in position of authority and if people can if kings and monarchs can be claiming such authority then who is deserving of more authority who is deserving of more respect who is deserving of more glory than the super than the supreme being who created humans who created genes who created the sevens heaven and hearts invariably the use of plural we in the holy quran does not in any way negate the core teachings of islam that teaches that islam teaches that allah is one rather it is a plural of respect and a plural of and not a plural of numbers who pay Allah in his magnanimous mercy continues to give us perfect understanding of his deen. Allahumma ameen.